relevant is the fact that Israel has not allowed me to enter the Palestinian territories uh, since I assumed this position in 2008. Uh, as far as um, uh, the, this recent incident is concerned, uh, I do and have consistently always condemned indiscriminate violence uh, against Israel if it, is, um, if it emanates from Gaza through um, the rocket fire. Uh, it's important to understand in these incidents, the uh, media doesn't report how they evolved. And in this case, for instance, the initial uh, violation of uh, the peace on the border uh, resulted from an Israeli incursion, uh, in land incursion into uh, Gaza. And uh, the response was a uh, relatively mild one. And then there was an interaction of rocket fire. It's now been apparently uh, quieted by uh, a ceasefire that Egypt has brokered. But the main point, I think, is yes, uh, uh, Palestinian indiscriminate violence is to be condemned. But the secondary point is that often these incidents of violence do not acknowledge the degree to which Israel has been the provocative actor in producing the violent interaction.